let's look at what we know. Baldur is Odin's finest tracker bar none. If he wants you, you have to consider the possibility that Odin wants you. And as for what Odin wants, on this I have some expertise. What could we have that Odin does? He's like the king of gods. Of the Aesir, aye. But his reach is not unlimited. And where he cannot reach, he is preoccupied with going. He certainly tortured me enough about it over the years. Another favor to ask you to. What do you want, dwarf? I got another lead on my old pal on Bari. Meet me at the Lonsuther Mines. There's some fancy dancy loot in it for you. Another lead? But we already found him. Well, found his hand, anyways. I'll explain at the mines. These ones is just south of the river pass. Now you two want something, or you just gonna stand there all gag-scrapped and slack-jawed? <laughs> Pulled the ring off on Vari's hand at the Bellander mines. Feller was always tampering with souls and dark rituals and matters of the night, see? Ah, uh, Alpine. I missed its gentle breeze and the sweet smell of honeysuckle and blood. Well... Judging by the sky, the Light Elves are in control of the light this time. Explain. You see, the Light Elves and Dark Elves... ...are always fighting over the light. That part we know. But did you also know that control of the light has changed hands no less than 213 times? Really? It's true. Each side believes itself the rightful keepers of the light and argue they're simply fighting for survival. But the fact of the matter is, the war has been going on so long, they don't know who they are without it. this up for me. Svartalfi means land of the Dark Elves. Right? Right. But you said the Dark Elves have been here now for a really long time. And anyway, aren't dwarves supposed to be from Svartalfi? They don't look like Dark Elves. Don't you think so? Then you are vastly more perceptive than the Aesir. They're the ones who apparently can't tell the difference. And they're the ones who came up with that name. 
Dwarves actually call their home realm Nidavalia. So the Dark Elves aren't from Svartalfheim at all? Not even a bit. They're just elves of another color. Nobody knows who came first, but they all come from Alfheim. Why do they fight all the time if they're really the same? Ready and that ready. That is adorable. Huh? It is the way of the world. Oh. Well, that's sad. You don't need to make excuses to say hello. There is a lot to see here. What's got you all bum fuzzled over there? Get going! Aye, it ranks among his foremost obsessions. But that doesn't make any sense to me. Oh? When did that stop making sense? We were saying Balder tracked us down to find the way to Yodan. But that was before we knew Yodan was where we needed to go. It's crazy. Except for one thing. You are headed for Yodan. So he was right. I'm so confused. Well then, clearly you've been listening. You all bum fuzzled over there. Get going. If you're thinking about hurling us all into the void, I hope you're quite sure. Wasn't it your idea? Find our own path, right? This is where Tyr stepped beyond, and the Unity Stone protected him. Ready? Ready. Well, if this is it, lads, it's been an honor. Our faith head. Oh, 
How can I be so nauseous without a stomach? Come on. That was great. Look. The tower. I knew there was something down here. Amazing. How do you hide something that exists in all realms? Cast it out of any realm to the space between. Clever old tear. Is Jotunheim on the other side? Can't be that. It's not like you go through Vanaheim to reach the Midgard Peak. But how do we use it? I'd suggest we look inside and stay alert. Tyr's little challenges are never as simple as they appear. I have noticed. Well, this is sparse. The pedestal. Absorbing the stone's energy. Something's happening. Is it moving? It's moving. It knows what to do. The stone served its purpose. We're fulfilling Tyr's spell. What happens now? No idea, brother. But after that fall, I'm sure we're past the worst of it. Oh, no, this is considerably worse. <laughs>
consider a tactical retreat. That was tough. Where do you think it's taking us next? I do not know. Oh no! We're back in hell? Oh dear, here they come. Be ready!
back in Midgar. There's the bridge. We did it. The tower's back where it belongs. Now Tyr's travel room can take us to Jotunheim. How did Tyr do this? Odin suspected the giant secretly possessed some remnant of primordial Jotnar creative essence. The stuff all realms are made of. The Unity Stone must have been fashioned from that essence. To trust an outsider with it, even Tia, tells you just how desperate they were. And look! Now we can finally light all the braziers and see what happens. Tia's braziers. A symbol of the light that binds all realms together. Why would he use those strange runes, though? Now you mention it, he wouldn't. Uh.